Hey, I'm Benjamin Franklin, and you're watching Disney Channel. What do you expect me to do the arm things? Like this isn't stop motion, man. I can't move my arms. All right, hello. I'm Benjamin Franklin, and I am quite an awesome guy. Probably one of the coolest people in American history. I mean, like at least cooler than Gerald Ford. What'd that guy do, anyways? Anyways, so I'm here, and I've got a new book, and I wanted to read some passages for you before we get started. It is a book of quotes by me, Benjamin Franklin, one of the most famous people ever. Alright, let's go ahead and look at the book first before we get into some of the quotes that I have for you. Alright, here's the book. Yeah, yeah, I made that all myself. Yep. Alright, let's go ahead and read some of it. Yokoya Port was a town easy to overlook. Situated in the edge of Whale Tail Strait, it could have been... A major restocking point for ships leaving one of the many harbors that supplied Omashu. But the strong, relatable prevailing winds are too easy and too cost effective for sovereign bound merchants to cruise right past it and reach Shashiraj, a big island in the Strait Point. Yeah, I wrote that. Thank you. Wait a second, I don't remember writing any of that. Anyways, let's go ahead and get into some quotes. Sure, I will hit it. A penny saved means you have one penny. There was never a bad war or a good peace. Money always made a man happy, and it will always. The more money a man has, the more money a man has. Instead of filling a vacuum with money, just put the money in your wallet. Beer is proof that there's a liquid that can get people drunk. Make yourself sheep and you can make your own pillow. Well done is better than well dumb. This one is probably one of my favorites that I've written. On that first day of January in the year of our Lord 1863, all persons held as slaves within any state or designated part of a state, the people wherefore shall then be in rebellion against the United States shall then be henceforward and forever free, and the executive government of the United States, including the military and naval authority thereof, will recognize and maintain the freedom of such persons. Well, Ben, I'm pretty sure you made up most of those, and that last one was from Abraham Lincoln. What, were you there, Mikey, huh? Yeah, I was. Oh, yeah. Uh...